Well, hello there, guys. You guys have asked many, many times, and I'm finally doing it, Theater of War. This is the first time I've actually played Theater of War. I played a few minutes of Theater of War 3. I really liked it, but I do find it to be a very complex game uh, and definitely one of the earlier games. Uh, the same company, I believe. Uh, is it the same company that made Graviteam Tactics? I think it is. I might be wrong about that. Um, in any case, we're going to go ahead and jump in. I'm going to do a single-player campaign, and like I said, I've none never played this game before. I might actually just do a single battle, um, but I actually want to do the campaign. Um, so let me do the campaign, and one of the cool things is look at all the choices. Um, just so many different choices. So I actually want to do the battle for Poland, as Poland, and uh, see how long we can survive. Probably not very. Uh, so here we go, guys. The battle orders are going to be interesting. Hold and defend the area specified. That seems pretty simple. Well, let's go ahead and jump in, guys, and see if we can have fun in theater of war. Okay, here we go, guys. Poland, September 1939. The Germans are advancing on us. Oh, my goodness. All right, this is going to be an interesting little battle to fight. So uh, I don't expect to win at all. We're playing as the Polish Home Defense Army uh, against the German attack force. And obviously, we're greatly outnumbered. Uh, but we sh should be cool to see how this battle goes. So I want to see how it's going to be set up, first of all. Got some German bombers approaching. For an older game, really nice little graphics going on here. And I believe this is our Polish Home Army. Oh my gosh! We've been strafed by Messerschmitts. Oh no! Yeah, we don't have any tanks as far as I know, just uh, sort of, I guess, motorized vehicles uh, with machine guns. Oh, Shazamo is a badano. I don't know what he's saying, but uh, that's it. Hold the area and defend. Okay, cool. So I guess we have to go ahead and actually start the battle. Um, and I just want to make sure that I'm starting it at the right time. I want these guns up. And I hope I can just, like, place them here. There should be a way, right? Or do I have to move them there? Try to drag. Oh, Agrippa's learning. Uh, so I'm going to drop one of them, like, here. I want to drape, like leave them kind of behind the trenches. Uh, one of them here. And one of them about right there. And let's go ahead and start the battle. So I'm hoping our guys will sort of react normally uh, to the German incoming attack. Let's go ahead and get a look at the Polish trenches. Doesn't look like we have many men here. Um, I mean, this is all we have, apparently. <laughs> And uh, we have to work with it. Repulse this initial attack of German troops. All right, here we go, guys. I'm wondering, is there a German air cover? There is German bombers approaching. I hope we don't have to deal with them. We've got a lot of uh, infantry over here, though, so hopefully these guys can hold out, hold up a pretty good fight. And again, it's not major squads. These are like individual units. So we have to hope that they can... Uh, they can put up a decent fight against the incoming enemy uh, without getting repulsed back. If they're repulsed back, we've lost. Now, this guy's got an anti-tank rifle. Makes me feel a little safer. But so far, we haven't seen any of the German attackers. We just have to wait. I actually want to aim this thing the right way. Let's get these guys to move. There we go. Why does it look like they're wearing German uniforms? I want to get look, look at this Polish artillery. Oh, okay. Fair enough. No, actually, they look much more Russian. Um... Polish Home Army definitely had their own sort of uh, uniforms. And I think aiming right down that road, that should be perfect. Wait a minute, what's happened here? Oh, we got strafed! One of our guns got strafed, guys. I'm going to go ahead and grab onto the Bofors. It looks like one of our guys might still be there. No, the entire group is dead. This guy here as well. All right, we've got some gunfire. There we go, enemy tanks, guys. Enemy tanks. And there we go, our guns are already opening fire here. Continue the fire, boys. Yes! Let's get a closer look here. Are we getting some hits? I think we are. There we go. Yes! Hit that German tank. Boom! There we go, guys. A German tank done. Uh, destroyed there. And the German crew is getting out, of course. We're just going to let them do their thing. We're not going to worry too much about them. I just hope that our AT guns can stay alive long enough to get some major kills. Beautiful. Some more hits there. You are doing this for the glory of your country. Holy crap, look at that incoming fire. Now, I can't tell if that's the German tanks opening fire on us or if that's direct air fire. It looks like it might be German air cover. Here we go, keep firing, boys. You are the salvation of Poland. Oh, man, that AT gun just got hit bad. He's still shooting, though. Nope, not anymore. That thing is taken out. Um, I don't think it's too damaged, though still working so I'm gonna grab two infantry units 
There's no other way to take out these tanks. So we better get used to infantry here. Let's take a look over here at the German lines. Okay, another tank. Beautiful. So we got that one, guys. And we might have just hit this one, too. That's what's hitting us so much. So this actual vehicle, um, it's a Panzer Aus FC, Panzer II. Uh, this thing just basically fires continuous rounds. It's pretty nasty. Now, these rounds can't contend with the bigger tanks like a T-34. They couldn't even pierce it. But against infantry, uh, that thing is going to destroy us. So I'm going to go ahead. I'm going to hope these guys... There we go. They're already firing away. They know how important it is to take that guy out quickly. Man, get back here. What are you doing? No, you can stay here and help your buddy load. Oh, my army. Polish home army has definitely been a bit shell-shocked. Does not want to go back. There we go. That's definitely a hit. I'm trying to see here if our anti-tank gunner has also gotten some hits. There we go. Come on, guys. Keep it up. You are the salvation. Skierczowicz. You have to hold. So far, I haven't seen any uh, enemy artillery. Or, excuse me, not enemy artillery. Enemy infantry, except now. We're starting to see some enemy, enemy infantry. So I hope we'll react well to it. Whoa! Nice shot there. We dropped something. But uh, that was a nice shot. Right, that's got to be our artillery, actually. Okay, so there's a lot of infantry here on this left side. I want to focus our artillery on the infantry. Actually, this is a Bofors. Well, let's see how it works. And I'm going to grab this guy. He's already wounded. Could actually probably move him back here. Is it just me, or is our Bofors kind of off track? I think this will do a lot better off, uh, I mean, versus tanks than versus infantry. So let's make sure that we're focusing it the right direction. All the tanks seem to be basically destroyed, guys. Um, we're just dealing with the Germans ahead of us right now. Unfortunately, we don't have many men to, to withstand this assault. Stay down. There we go. Okay, that's good. Still get some infantry down with the anti-tank gun. Let's take a look. German assault team! I would love to have some reinforcements right now. Um, I'm actually going to really quickly look back here. One of these is a howitzer. There we go. Now this can do some damage to infantry. Infantry! You will not trespass into Poland. Actually, we'll fire at these guys right here. Come on, guys. We've got to be quick about this. Oh, shit. One of them's down. Come on, boys. That's what I'm talking about. Do it for your fatherland. Wow, we've got major incoming fire here. We've really got to get a shot off. Just get one shell off at these guys and I'll be happy with you guys. I think one shell could kill many of them. Boom! There we go, there we go. It struck. Let's see if we got any kills. Definitely a devastating shot. That thing is deadly. Um, not sure if we did, but we're going to keep firing. I'm targeting this guy, and there we go. That's a definite kill. That German dropped like a sack of bricks. He's not getting up again. So we're going to have to hope that our howitzer can hold the enemy back. It looks like we've got a few more tanks on the scene. That's what these AT guns are for. This is why I'm glad I moved them right up to the front. I don't know how else we would have survived. We would not be, have been alive this long. Great shot there. Wow. We're getting so many great kills on the enemy tanks. We're actually annoying Hitler sufficiently right now. He uh, expected to walk right into Poland. We're What's definitely making it a little tougher for him. And there we go. We just got some reinforcements, guys. I'm going to focus the howitzer now on the tanks because the tanks are much more serious. And I want to see what our reinforcements are. It looks like we got even a tank. Wow, a TKS. So the Polish did have tanks. We're going to move our TKS into position. I'm almost also going to take one of these infantry units to retake this Bofors. Um, and assuming this truck has some infantry inside of it, it might not. Uh, but assuming it does, I might go ahead and take that truck and uh, unleash the infantry near this gun. We've also got another gun back here that could use some assistance, but right now I think it's important for us to just stay in the trenches and return fire. And our men are definitely returning fire here at the enemy. There we go, boys. I think, are we not using the same rifles? We're both using Car 98s. I'm pretty sure. Wouldn't be surprised. Nice shooting, boys. Continue that artillery assault. things don't start going better, we're going to have to uh, leave any moment uh, for Warsaw. But I think that we're doing a pretty good job right now. All things considered. Counterattack? Now you're talking crazy. 
All right, guys, so this is so far, like I said, my first um, actual gameplay into Theater of War. So what do you, how you guys think I'm doing? First of all, let me know in the comments down below. Um, we're going to have to do a counterattack, and I don't feel particularly confident about it. But at least we've got some reinforcements here to deal with the uh, infantry presence of the enemy. All right, looks like he got on the gun. Great job. This is another Bofors. Bofors aren't particularly useful against the infantry. And I always thought that Bofors were machine guns, but really it's more... Uh, I guess it depends. I'm sure they make all sorts of different guns. German tank. Get it. Yes! Nice hit! <laughs> These guys are definitely firing at the direction. A cup of borscht for any man that kills the tank. Polish Home Army! Man, he won't stop moving. This is a Panzer IV. You guys know it. We've used it many times in my Graviteen Tactics games. Uh, this is a monster right here. Uh, as Well, it's not a monster against a Tiger, but against the Polish Home Army, it's a monster. And uh, we're going to have to go ahead and deal with it. I'm really worried about this armored car getting shot at, because I don't see it destroying that Panzer IV. Let's also see, oh yes, we have definitely got infantry. So I'm going to drop the infantry over here. Disembark. There we go. Alright, I'm going to try to take over uh, this gun. So I'm actually going to take some of these guys, send them to the gun. And some of them I'll put in the trench. Go, boys, go. There we go. It's down. The Panzer IV is down. It's apparently still shooting, but uh, the crew is definitely dead. So it must be a ghost. I'm worried. All right, here we go, guys. So sending some infantry to crew this area, obviously. And uh, we also have some grenades, which would be useful if any of the infantry break through. And there we go. Our tank is ready. Let's move it up. In fact, let's target the Panzer IVs. I don't think we're going to stand well against them, but we have to try. TKS. Show us you mean business. We got more Panzer IVs over here. Oh my goodness. Alright, we've got to get those infantry to also react. So I'm actually going to aim at the Panzer IVs attacking on this side. I'm more concerned about them than anything else. Get them, boys. Get them. Already we've lost one tank. And that armored car as well. I'm going to send the rest of this infantry over here. Come on, TKS. You guys are not <clears throat> not doing a good job to promote the TKS name. We've also got this uh, anti-tank guy. Should be able to do something. There we go. Yes! Come on. Keep up with the progressive fire. We've got to take these tanks out. I think we have someone else back here. Maybe not. So concerned about the tank right now. I can't think of anything else. Get it, guys! Alright, we got our guy on the AT gun. Can he do anything? On the Bofors, anyway. Boom. Alright, we took off a piece, definitely. Did we just take the turret off? I think we might have just shot one of the turrets off. We definitely put a hole in the tank. Alright, go ahead. Use your anti-tank. I hope you have anti-tank rounds. Shit. That's it. The TKS have been destroyed. Definitely returning fire. But to what end? Well, let's set these guys up here. We're going to put this guy over here. Just try to get on those guns, because that's the only thing we can use to fight back. Uh, anything else is pretty paltry against those uh, those Panzer IVs. Oh, shit! Alright, let's go back, 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 back. Alright, we definitely got one of them, but not all. Come on, boys. Get on it, crew. Get on it. Three German tanks right on us. I know there's something else back. I knew there was something. The Bofors. Get late for that now. Oh, yeah, we're finished. 
Let's at least grab this gun. Wow. So that's a major German attack there. I mean, we've put up a pretty good fight, I think. All things considered, as the home defense army of Poland. Uh, you know, we have very few men compared to the Germans, obviously. And I didn't expect us to even get this far and kill as many tanks as we did. Um, but obviously, we could have done better. And no, we've got an STKVZ. I hate those. I hate those in every World War II game. I even hate them when I'm controlling them. They're just too OP against infantry. And I don't see this ending well. Don't be panicked. We're gonna get this crew to man this gun at least. And some of these guys, like Fabian Zoltowski, are in panic. They, they want nothing to do with this battle and they're getting the hell out. Alright, I might have to put this guy up here. Actually, let's get down here. If we can get over here and drop these guys off. Oh, there's a lot of possibility because there are a lot of guns in this area. Um, a lot of anti-tank guns. We've got an anti-tank gun on this truck. But I feel like the enemy is going to destroy us at any second here. Oh, that's what I'm talking about. We got to disembark. We got to disembark. Move, 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 move. Someone get on the damn gun. We have to unload the gun, I think. Shit. Micromanaging this game is definitely tough. Um... Detach. I guess this is attach, so we want detach. Here we go. Let's get on that Bofors. Move this truck out of the way. Oh, that's a bit tough now. <laughs> All right, the Bofors will have to stay. <laughs> the truck will have to stay. Get on it. Now it's a bit of an exercise in futility. But we'll keep up the fight. Turn it this way, guys. There. We oh, my goodness. Look at how the Germans eliminated us. <laughs> it's a dark day for Poland. Um, we still got this guy. Could probably go ahead and aim the main gun over. Nope. Uh, at this point, they have totally taken over. There's really very little we can do. I think we only have two you soldiers left. Done. Hold and defend the area specified. What are you crazy? Can't hold anything. I guess we'll move back to the town. But uh, we definitely lost. So there we go, guys. Defeat! Anyway, that was my first foray in the theater of war. Um, so we destroyed 64 enemy uh, soldiers. Uh, three tanks, three vehicles. We lost 52 on our end, 10 tanks. Are that, is that enemy casualties? Oh, sorry. Player count. Let's redo that. So we actually killed less of their men than they did of ours. Uh, but we killed more of their tanks, which is awesome. Ten. And just very interesting. I want to see if the campaign continues or if I have to win this mission uh, to continue the campaign. Uh, it looks like yes, I probably do. But very cool stuff there. Um, maybe we'll try again with a different faction. Hope you guys enjoyed that quick look. And uh, thank you so much for watching the video. Take care.